found out for the first time that I had breast cancer about six years ago and I had a lumpectomy at the time and then last July of 2013 I had an MRI and a biopsy which had shown that the breast cancer had come back and my options were to have a lumpectomy again followed by radiation. I remember seeing on national TV about a new procedure called IORT and made an appointment to come down here at the Women's Center to meet with Dr. Holmes and get more information on it. He walked in and introduced himself as Dennis Holmes, whereas most physicians would walk in and say, hi, I'm Dr. So-and-so. So that put me at ease. He just made me feel very comfortable. He explained the procedure and how it would be performed. He felt that I would be a candidate about 10 years ago, uh, I learned of uh, an approach that was being considered as a way for reducing the burden of breast radiotherapy. It's called intraoperative radiotherapy. Uh, I decided with my colleagues that that's something that we should explore, that we should be involved in the clinical trial to evaluate its effectiveness. That we did, and 10 years later, I'm happy to say that we found a treatment that is a game changer when it comes to reducing the burden of cancer therapy. I thought IORT as an option was fantastic. And the reason for that was that there was, was no ongoing radiation treatment after the initial surgery. The radiation was done during surgery and the recovery rate seemed to be about the same from what we were able to find out. So to me that was a fantastic option. Normally Radiation after lumpectomy requires a six-week course of treatments given every day after you finish surgery. Intraoperative radiotherapy reduces that six-week course of radiotherapy to a 30-minute treatment given immediately after tumor removal during surgery. So a patient comes in, she has her cancer removed, she has radiotherapy given at the time of surgery, takes 30 minutes, she goes home, and both radiation and surgery are completed in that one visit to the hospital. The side effects are also reduced by limiting the side effects to the part of the breast that's at most risk for cancer recurrence. Surgery is, is a, a team endeavor. It involves the surgeon as part of the team, it involves the anesthesiologist, it involves the nursing staff, and it involves me as the support person. Everybody who came in and spoke with us and interacted with, with us was very sensitive to my wife, sensitive to me, and was responsive to whatever needs that she had. I felt great. I was up and about the next day, eating and everything. It was a much better experience than my first surgery.